Hello, hello, lads and girls. This is Lord Kicker, and welcome back to another episode of UC8 Lacrimosa of Jonah. And um, come to think of it, I think I'm actually gonna warp back here to the village because I kind of need to get myself some health potions. Hmm. Maybe some ways to like revive and stuff. Let's see what I can cook. SP region. Nullify status effects. XP gain. Break rate, XP gain. Damn, that one is good though, but it um, sticks around for quite a while. Uh, SP regen is really good though. Uh, brew. Okay, I got nine empty bottles. I can make four of these. That is extremely good, though. Although that requires moonlight grass. Uh, do I have so I can get like empty bottles from you? Hey, by the way, ever heard of aura grass? It's very rare and used as an ingredient in special medicines. I was able to find lots of them in the northern region of this island. So I've added aura grass to my trade goods. Come and check it out if you want. Let's see, I think I'm gonna trade down if I'm gonna go for the glass, right? Or am I trading up for those? I feel like I missed them. I know you have them in a the shop, though. Cabbage recipe. Beast Guide. Okay, cool. Um, I 
Why do I feel blind? See you later. Yeah, you don't have them there either, so... Maybe she doesn't have them anymore. I mean, I know she used to have empty glass. See you later. Uh, here you go. Why are you giving me this? For your hard worth at X. I feel I felt like it. <laughs> I think I should be uh, the one saying that to you. But hey, this is nice. I like random acts of kindness. This coin is from the kingdom of Eternia. I bet I could get a mountain of gold if I sell it on the mainland. But I'll probably never find another one, so maybe I should hold on uh, to it as a keepsake. Oh, shocker. You want to sell it? Oh, shocker. <laughs> I know, right? I don't know how else to describe this coin, except that it uh, it's a memento of my time on this island. If you want your business to thrive, it's important to nature those kind of feelings. And again, I bet this coin is extremely valuable. If I show it off to collectors I know, I'd net a tidy profit. And I wouldn't have to work for several months, but... Ugh, ugh. Don't for yourself. I, I'm not forcing myself for anything. I'll try not to think about it. Thank you, Adol. I'll keep it as a nice memento. Alright, maxed out. Wanna come with me? Oh? Huh? No present. Money bag! Bag contains 10,000 gold pieces. What is this? Where did you get this money? What kind of question is that for a merchant? I've had this cash with me the whole time. Anyway, once we get off this island, you're gonna head off on your next big adventure, huh? If you find any rare items, just bring them to me like you've been doing. That 100,000 denier you're holding, consider it a prepayment for those items. <laughs> What's the catch? I never said I would accept this. What's the catch? Hmm. Looks like you're trying to figure out how to back out of this. Sorry, but you agreed to my contract the moment you took that back from me. And if you're gonna breach that contract, you gotta pay a 200 Shut up and bring me some treasure! <laughs> Man. Uh, sorry, sorry. I was just messing around about the whole contract thing. Your reaction was funny, so I wanted to see how far I could take things. Really, I just wanted to show you my appreciation somehow. But all I have to give you is money. So please, just take it and don't overthink this. Don't even sweat the cash. I can make that back in a day once I'm off this island. And if you really don't want it, just throw it in the ocean. Or donate it to charity. <laughs> Are we good? Then let's get back to work! <laughs> He's a very nice person, though. Alright, uh, cool. 
Well, not really what I wanted to do, but sure. Uh, man, I should get back to uh, the mission. Let's warp. I got stuff to do. Can't hang around here all day. Here we go. Whoa! Look at the tree. It's huge. The tree of psyches has grown so much. It's mesmerizing. Wow! It's beautiful. So what? So how does one go about receiving this power? Does Donna receive it? No. The power of the psyches conflicts with providence and natural law. It exists in direct opposition to the essence wielded by Eternians. Therefore, I would like to ask you, Adol, to receive the power. I'll do it. Are you sure? Um, if you and Donna can't do it, who else can? We could draw straws. <laughs> I would prefer that Adol receive the power. Now, face the tree and raise your sword, the symbol of your strength. Fine, I'll do it. As Adol held his sword, he felt a torrent of power surge into it. So I got up to level 100. <laughs> Not sure what's going to happen though. Well, I got a new blade. Oh yeah, that is a big badass blade. Mistaline obtained. We got places to be. Oh yeah, I can go into each and every one here, it seems. Let's warp. I'm big. Donna, Adol. It seems you have received the power of the Psychis without issue. Sarai. So, how do we stop the Lacrimosa? Yeah. You must continue on ahead. The selection sphere. With that sword, Adol should be able to cut open an entrance. The selection sphere. Sphere. Wonder what's inside. The foundational power that forced the evolution of all living beginnings on this planet. The providence of evolution itself. Providence of evolution? So if we interfere with the providence of evolution, the Lacrimosa will stop? Yes, but if the providence of evolution is the natural law of the world itself, 
I do not know what will happen if you interfere with it. Hmm? Uh... Does that mean the world get destroyed? Well, there's no time to think about it. Dodgy and the others can't defeat, defend the village much longer. We can do this, guys. <laughs> We've been uh, honing our castaway spirit since we washed up on this island. So let's show them how far we've come. When it comes to survival, no one's more stubborn than us humans. It's, humans n it's human nature to never give up. Let's press on, even if we're wrong. Sounds best to say this. Yes, that's how we've survived. Adol, everyone. <laughs> you decided then. Thank you for everything, Sarai. Your thanks is not necessary. Now hurry on ahead. I can't help you where you're going, but I will be praying for your success. <sighs> All right. Let's see what we can do. That is really bright. This enormous structure is the selection sphere where the providence of evolution dwells. Adol Thord can cut open an entrance. Yes, go ahead, Adol. Yeah. I'm to be badass. Did she get a scarlet of vision? What did you see? What's wrong? I'll tell you when this is all over. All right. I'm pretty sure she had a scarlet of vision. Looks freaky. Is that a primordial? It's even bigger than the Oceanus. That is the providence of evolution. <laughs> We've come this far. Might as well finish the job. Let's go, Adol. Everything will be all right. Well, I hope so. But tell you what though, I think I'm going to end off this episode here and I do hope you've enjoyed it and I hope to see you all in the next one. Until then, bye bye.